Hey folks, Dominic here with the Gambler's Ruin Project. Tottenham versus Manchester United this Saturday. Two giants, messy injuries, and a clash of predictions. Today, our Spectra AI model versus Grok's human style read. Which one gives the edge? Let's break it down. Quick spoiler. Both expect goals, they just disagree on who wins. Let's go. Our Spectra AI puts United ahead. Away 39.1%, draw 34.4%, home 26.5%. Expected goals? Tottenham 1.37, Man United 2.65. Big tilt toward United's attack. Grok, on the other hand, predicts a 2-1 Spurs win. Both predictions say goals. But why the split? I'll explain. Spectra is an ensemble. Random Forest, Light GBM, XG Boost, and ANN, and calibrated Naive Bays all combined. It runs 10,000 Monte Carlo Sims. Results. About 2,701 home wins, 3,854 draws, 3,445 away wins. The model weights skew toward components that forecast more away goals. Hence the 2.65 XG for United. Poisson markets back this. Over 2.5 sits at 66.5%, and BTTS yes, at 69.3%. That tells us Spectra expects chances at both ends and a high likelihood of both teams scoring. Grok's pick is more tactical. Spurs' recent home form, psychological edge in the head-to-head, -head, and the argument that Spurs' youth will step up. So Grok favors 2-1 to one Tottenham. That's a classic context-beats-raw-data call. And remember, a 2-1 to one outcome still agrees with Spectra on goals. It's just a flip on who takes the lead. Tottenham's injury list is brutal. Names like Madison and Kulisevsky. Grok says, home patchwork can plug the gaps. Spectra quantifies the impact and still leans United, probably because United's attack metrics, when modeled, produce more and better chances. The real swing here is minutes played and late lineup news. Those change probabilities fast. So what's the pragmatic play? If you like value, consider a modest stake on United at the implied edge Spectra shows and lean heavier on BTTS or over 2.5. Those are both strongly supported. If you prefer narrative, a small Spurs outright bet is defensible. And if you're conservative, combine a small draw hedge with a BTTS stake. Monte Carlo shows draws are the plurality outcome. Important. Both systems give you probabilities, not certainties. Spectra's CI ranges and Grok's qualitative read both carry risk. Only stake what you can afford to lose. We report, you decide. Spectra's top scoreline is 2 to 1. The presence of 2 to 1 and 3 to 1 among top outcomes confirms. Expect goals and a tight result. To wrap, Spectra favors United by probability and XG. Grok favors Spurs via context. Both expect goals. My read for the Gambler's Ruin Project? Small, smart stakes on goal markets plus a measured outright play based on live lineup news. I'll be watching for the starting 11 announcement. That's the decider. If you enjoyed the breakdown, smash that like, subscribe, and follow the Gambler's Ruin Project for the post-match decode. I'll be back after the final whistle with the results versus the models. See which one learned the harder lesson.